like I say, obviously, you know, the decision to retire has been made. It's been an extremely tough call to make, considering that I've played rugby for this club for such a long time, and uh, I've loved doing that. You know, every time I pull on that shirt, I like to think that I've, I've given my absolute all to to try and help the team be successful. Uh, so, it, 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 you know, given given that, it makes the decision tougher to make, but. Ultimately, it's the right call. Uh, my quality of life has been affected now with, with this injury to the point where it's, it's been quite debilitating for me. And, uh, you know, sense has to prevail at some point and you have to you know, call time and, and get myself right, which, which is ultimately what I'm going to do. Uh, the privilege has been all mine to represent this club. Uh, I've literally came off the terraces as a 17, 18 year old season ticket holder to, to pull on the shirt and and, and go on and kind of live, live a childhood, every probably St Helens boy's childhood dream, and represent the club. And to do it for so long and have have as much success as I've had has been, has been fantastic. Uh, and it's certainly not lost on me. It was an extremely difficult conversation he had this morning. I had to go and obviously sit down with the rest of the squad and inform them of my decision, which uh, was a lot more difficult than I thought it would be. Uh, you know, you share some special times with a lot of players and. And uh, to, to actually, you know, to take them down and, and call time, and it was, was tough. I suppose, for, from my perspective, I've just got, you know, some thank yous that I, I need to make. Uh, you know, first of all, to to Eamon and Mike and, and people at the club over this last, four, and, and obviously Kieran as, as head coach, is over the last few months, I've I've been doing it tough in trying to get myself right and trying to get myself back on the field. I've exhausted every avenue in trying to get myself fit. And the club have shown, you know, ex you know, wonderful patience and and given me, you know, the best support necessary in, in trying to do that. And 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 now, and you know, when I spoke to them in, in the recent weeks about retiring, they've been equally supportive as well. So I, I didn't expect anything different, but all the same, it, it's great to have. Uh, I want to thank you know teammates, both past and present, who I've shared so many great times with. It's. Uh, you know, it's a special club to play for, and, but the, the relationships and the bonds that you build over that time are what make it special. And to show, to have so many great friendships uh, come out of the game, and now I retire, I've you know built a lot of great relationships there with some some wonderful people. Uh, my family's been a huge source of support for me over the years. My parents in particular, and my wife Rachel. I think you know people speak about rugby players making sacrifices. Uh, we do make sacrifices in order to be in order to be successful, but the people closest to you are the ones that make sacrifices too. Uh, you know, when you're going off on tours, you know, someone has to look after your children. Uh, you know, in the early parts of your career, when your parents are driving you either and everywhere to games, to, you know, give you the best opportunity to succeed. You know, they're they're making sacrifices too. And finally, uh, you know, I'd, I'd like to thank you know the amazing supporters at this club who. Now, when you live in the town and you grow up as a St Helens supporter, you you understand what it means to represent this club. And uh, when you play, comes a certain responsibility and to to represent the people of the town. Uh, I like to think uh, I've done that. But wherever I've gone, whether it's you know to the petrol station, to the local supermarket, down the local pub, wherever, the, the support of the town have been absolutely unbelievable with me. And uh, you know, I'd like to thank them for their continued support over the years. Uh, again, just reiterate, it's been the, the privilege has been all mine, uh, and thank you very much.